Six people died in Dream Warriors, and the victims consisted of three males and three females, and even split between men and women fatalities. With a runtime of 96 minutes, that comes out to a kill on average every 16 minutes flat. I'll give oh hey, not bad. Seven people died in the Dream Master, as long as we're counting Freddy, which I will. The victims included four guys and three girls, which means Freddy once again killed his victims in a fair and balanced way. At a runtime of 93 minutes, that comes out to a kill on average about every 13 minutes. I'll give 16 people died in My Bloody Valentine. The victims consisted of 11 guys and 5 girls, a more than 2 to 1 dude heavy ratio. With a runtime of 93 minutes, that comes out to a kill on average every 5.81 minutes. Only three people died in the Dream Child, the lowest of the Nightmare series, and tied for the lowest of any Kill Count episode. The victims were two dudes and one lady, which is obviously a 2 to 1 male heavy ratio, and with a runtime of 90 minutes, that's a kill on average every half hour. 20 people died in President's Day, which means we got a kill for every president, up to and including Garfield. The victims included 10 men and 10 women, giving us a 50-50 gender split, something not seen in a US election since 1976. With a runtime of 82 minutes, that gives us a kill on average about every 4 minutes. Six people died in Freddy's Dead, including two people in flashbacks and, of course, Freddy Krueger himself. All in all, the victims included five men and one woman, the most imbalanced gender ratio of the entire series. With a runtime of 89 minutes, that comes out to a kill on average every 14.83 minutes.